Hello, I'm going to be showing you how to use user menu commands and message menu commands. This is, this is a menu for messages and users that do a certain actions when you activate them. <clears throat> Let's get started. So, I've, I've created a user menu command, uh, send embed. Uh, uh, so, yeah, you can make it whatever you want, personal preference. Let's create an action. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna do a uh, store member member object because we're gonna have to store the interacted user. Now this is important. The interacted user is is what what's the member you interact with with the user mini command. So it's important. And the object is for right the member because we need this because send message is not gonna work. So we're gonna have to do let's call it var and so we're gonna do variable variable and var yes so we're gonna do uh, even testing embeds create one title even v2 embed test uh, made the color I don't know I don't know red timestamp sure description just say test so that's that we create the action and we stop a bot save it and run it she you should know how to do that by now uh, so if we go to our man johnny right here see apps uh, send embed we do it runs the command now if we go to our account it'll see that it sent the embed uh with our exact thing we've set it to do which is good it worked so if you want to recap uh, make sure you always do store member info just in case there is gonna be some like member member actions that have like the member in it like member control uh, member member control uh, member control it's always gonna have it most of them are not gonna have interacted user so storing the member info for the interacted user, storing in a variable name, will fix it. So you know you have you have the member object and who to send it and who to get all that stuff. Hopefully that makes sense. Oh my god, <laughs> Jesus! Um, let's create a new act, new command. Now this is the message menu. We're gonna call it repeat uh, message menu. So, we're going to do what we did, but this time we're going to do store message info and command message. Command message is going to be the, the, the message you, you, um, you interact with. So, do that. We're going to do the message object just in case. And we're going to copy the action. Uh, temp variable, message, text, txt. Uh, and then it'll we'll make it send txt the uh, the text, and we suffer bot. We save it and we run it. So now, if we right click on our message apps repeat, we click on it. It it sent the exact thing, exact same thing. We set it to repeat, and it works. So if we so if we say like hi and repeat it works and that's pretty much it have a nice day